Hey, it's Peter here from Renew Me Again. First of all, as always, I'd like to thank you all for subscribing. And if you do like my videos, please do subscribe to them and please do share them because um, you know, when the word gets around about this lifestyle and how we can actually rejuvenate our faces naturally, um, so many more people out there want to know about it and they don't actually know about it. I talk to a lot of people about facial exercises. Uh, a lot of people do comment on my skin and how fantastic it looks. And I tell them I, I use my Renumi products, I use my little red light laser, but I also uh, you do facial exercises. And that is the one thing that we all can do, regardless of whatever products you use or whatever devices you use, we can all do facial exercises and we all benefit. So there are many, many people out there that still don't know about it. So thank you so much for subscribing and sharing because um, it really does help the cause. Okay guys, so today I thought I'd do a video on lymphatic drainage. Now the reason why I've done this is because I have been sick for the last two weeks. I've had the flu, it's been a chesty flu, I've had a lot of phlegm in my throat, had a, a snotty nose and uh, a, a very um, a doughy head all for the last two weeks. So um, I thought I'd start doing some lymphatic drainage and then I thought well I might as well just share it with you guys. So in, in simple terms, the lymphatic system in our body uh, has two purposes. It feeds the blood with um, uh, essential vitamins um, and it converts the vitamins and then it feeds them into the blood and then also it acts as an elimination uh, for the toxic waste that's left over. Um, so they're, they're in very simple terms that's um, basically what the lymph system does. Um, and there are many many um, lymph nodes and, and all sorts of systems through our body. It's very complex and it runs alongside of the, uh, the circulatory system. So basically what we're going to do today is we're going to concentrate on our neck, uh, the back of our neck, the side of our neck and around our face. Now I don't know about you but um, often I look at people and I can see that their faces are very puffy. Now this is for a number of reasons but one reason is because they're not eliminating the lymph out of their uh, face um, regularly. And this is because what happens is the lymph system becomes a little bit stagnant and that goes back to the type of food that we're eating, uh, the elimination that we're doing daily um, and all of that sort of thing. So we can help this along by uh, just doing very light uh, massage on our face. So when we first start this, um, there are a few contraindications to it. Um, if you have a tumour, um, if you have um, problems with your circulatory system, uh, you might need to go to the doctor first to find out how to do this and whether it's okay for you to do lymph massage. But if you are in general health and good health, but you're suffering from puffy face, um, you can do this. Okay, so what we're going to do is just going to use our fingers again. And we're going to find the area just above our collarbone. Okay, so it's this area in here. Alright? So we put three fingers there and we're just using our fingers. So three fingers there. And what we do is we start to gently pump. Now you can see how gentle I'm doing it. You don't need to do it um, like really heavy. You just need to gently pump it. Now we start from the bottom because now you can all, already hear my voice. <clears throat> because phlegm starts to build up in the back of your throat and this is the lymph coming out and these are the toxins coming out um, of your head. So if I'm swallowing it's because there's phlegm building up. Okay, so the reason why we start at the bottom is we start pumping but what happens is it starts a vacuum and it starts a drain. Okay, so this is what we want to achieve. So we do this probably 50 to 100 times just to start. Okay, so we're just gently pumping and bit by bit if you are a little bit sinusy, if your nose is blocked, if your ears are blocked, you'll start feeling very subtle changes in your head. Okay, so let's say we've done 50. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so then we go to this area here. Now this is a very big area where the lymph drains. At the end of the video, I'll put a uh, picture up of where the lymph nodes are and the lymph veins are, or the lymph vessels are. So there's another big area here. So what we do is we just start gently 
moving it down. So again, it's going to start moving the lymph. Okay, so we do that about 50 times. Then we go to the back of the neck. Now right just um, to the back of the neck where, um, where our neck is, we just place our fingers on our neck like this. Okay, and then we just pull them down. So basically, if that's my neck, we just pull it down nice and gentle. So it's nice and gentle, and we're just pulling out the lymph. And again, you can just imagine it starting to flow and starting to activate in your head and all these toxins starting to remove from your head. Now you might start to feel a build up in the back of your throat now, a phlegm. I certainly am. Okay, so we do that 50 times, nice and gently. Then we do the, um, this, we all know who does this if you're a Trekkie fan. Okay. So we do the, um, the Live Long and Prosper, which is um, very well known for Dr. Spock. But anyway, so it works for us as well. So what we do is we place it over our ears. So you see if my hair is out the way. You see, sometimes I find it hard to do that Live Long and Prosper. But anyway, we've got to work at it. So you can see it placed over the ears. So then we just bring it down. Okay? And we just gently bring this down. So we do this about 50 times. Okay. So then there are other lymph vessels in our face as well. Now this is one of the reasons why we puff up here. And you've heard me talking about this before. Because we can use my little device uh, to help release and relieve that area of your sinuses as well. So after we do the ears... We start around the mouth. Now there are lymph nodes, and very, very gently, just very gently, and we do that about 50 times. Now if you can't do it 50 times, just do it 20 times. I mean, it's not, um, there's no science to it, but just very gently. Okay. Now up around here, there are lymph nodes as well. So we go around with our fingers, and very, very gently, now some of you will have bags around your eyes and I know um, eye bags can be very distressing because um, the eyes are the window to the soul, everybody looks at your face and I know it can be very inhibiting for some people. So when you're doing this, if you do have bags around your eyes, just very, very gently and you can see how gently, you can actually use your ring fingers and very gently, just like as light as a feather because what happens is that because the bags stretch the skin a bit so as you move it out and as the, um, the lymph starts draining, it's going to um, leave some uh, sort of baggy skin there. So you have to be very, very careful. Now for me, I do a lot of this with my uh, little device, so I don't have eye bags, which I very, feel very fortunate about. So I do it a little bit, a little bit stronger because there's not, it's not going to drag on my skin because from the exercises and from the device, the skin is quite strong on the top of my eye, um, on the, uh, my, around my eyes, sorry. So, um, just very gently. Now, when you finish doing this, you go up along here. Now, this here releases your sinuses. Okay, and this releases your sinuses as well. So, up around here, very gently, very, very gently. Okay. So if you want to do it 20 or 30 times to, you know, um, uh, make it go a, a shorter, that's fine too. But you might want to build up to about 50 times. So then once we finish doing this, we just go backwards. Okay? So we go around the eyes gently, very gently. And because we've got all lymph down here, drains and nodes and all sorts of stuff here, we just push it gently down. Push it gently down. And then around the face, around here. And around the nose area. Okay. And then the live long and prosper. I'm still having problems doing it. So we do it along here. 
If you can't do it, just use your fingers, it's, um, it's okay. Okay, so, and then behind the neck. And it's almost like you're pumping a little bit this way as well, because you want to just create that drainage. Okay, and then down here, and then pumping here to finish. And it's not a, you know, it's just a, quite a relaxing thing to do as well. Now you can do this, um, you, you need to do this when you're sitting up. Um, so the uh, gravity pulls on, um, on the drainage. So you need to do that. And when you finish, just push it gently down. Okay, so the other thing with this is that you can use the device. And I've used the device before, it's my little device. When you're doing your drainage, you're just doing it very gently. Again, now with the device, what this does is it's got little electro uh, electronic um, pulses that push through the skin. And because the lymph system or the lymphatic system is very close to the skin, um, and it's close to the skin because what it does is it squeezes out um, skin tissue. Um, and then uh, it's, it, anyway, it's quite complicated, but anyway, it's quite, it's, it's close to the skin. Let's put it that way. So we just gently, very gently allow it to push and we just do the same, exactly the same um, movements that you would with your face. Now the benefits of using the device is there's a little laser in it as well which helps, uh, helps the process and it's got the microcurrent and of course you're getting the, the benefit of the microcurrent that's exfoliating the skin at the same time um, and then you don't need to buy an exfoliator. Um, but you can use the device and you can use the device down here, you can even use it along here and along here and that just gently helps um, massage and gently sends those little electronic pulses through the skin that allows it to uh, start draining. And it's quite relaxing as well. Um, as I say, even this is quite relaxing because you get the warm, little warm buzz of the microcurrent. Okay, so that's where we are today. I hope you're having a lovely day wherever you are in the world. I hope you enjoy this video. Please do comment. Please, um, please make comments below if you enjoy the video. Please do subscribe to the video. And also, um, please have a look at the end of the video because uh, there are some pictures there um, when I turned 50 and um, they're really different to what I look today. And I can really say to you that um, I have made some tremendous changes in three years uh, with my skin, with working on my skin, and I haven't had to go and do anything um, to anything um, unnatural to um, uh, to have my skin look as good as it does. I, it's obviously, I wear a bit of makeup, and that's all. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much, and um, love to hear from you very soon. And we'll see you next time. Bye.